Welcome back to Alpha 21. I'm King of the Zeds, our mini bike and our backpack are packed to the brim with all our gear and we're heading out to new pastures. Destination, big city in the snow. So we're gonna stop for gas along the way, but our main objective for the day is to locate said city, scout for a place to call home and lock it the f down. So let's get going. I think we must be getting close to our final destination, guys. What is this? Uh, well, whatever it is, the checkpoint seems to be closed, so I guess we're going around. <laughs> yeah, this appears to be a fabled big city in the north. So I'm thinking maybe a little house on the outskirts of town might be a good place to set up base sort this guy out before he does us. Maybe we'll just go and have a look. There seems to be some houses this way before we pop and see Jen because I've got an inventory full of stuff so I'm not going to be able to do much until I offload it. Yeah, definitely suburbia here but these houses all look huge. <laughs> What's going to make a good little place to settle down? All right, maybe we'll just have a little drive around first, as it happens. It looks like we're going straight from suburbia into the downtown. I wouldn't mind, like, to just be on the roof of a some sort of store again, but we don't appear to be coming across that kind of area just yet. Yeah, very, very dodgy part of town to be in right now. Yeah, Shotgun Messiah Factory. I expect we will be paying this place a visit at some point. Is that the hospital right there as well? Yeah, it looks like. Okay, and I think I can see just off in the distance. Should we go and have a look at this? The new apartment block. Yeah, it looks like we have the vanity tower. Sweet. Okay, we are a bit spoiled for choice now. I don't mind the idea of that passing gas there. Maybe we can do something with that, but that is an old place. We'd like to do something with a new a new POI, maybe see if we can turn something into a combined home base and horde base. Right, I'm just going to grab a bit more gas from some of these cars and then maybe we will just take a little bit more of a drive around. I would like to stay on this side of the town because that's where Jen is. Alright, anyway, I'll get some gas and then we can go on a bit of a drive. Oh my god. I'll have that please. Okay, here we go. We're actually not too far from all the stores and everything as well. So this is all very good. <laughs> what is this place? Oh, I'm really tempted to have a pirate ship on top of the base. Although, I'm just trying to get close to it, I can't see. Oh yeah, okay, three star, or three skulls. Um, Alright, let me just take this guy out. Yeah, I'm just, just thinking it would be fun to have a pirate ship on top of our, uh, on top of our base. At the very least, okay, decision made. We are going to loot this place. I've got a box that I've made ready to just bung down and stick some stuff while we uh, while we clear something out. Let's take on this place, the Berg Kinnear. <laughs> Fucking hell. And are we just going straight in through the front door? Yes. Is do we just go and take a seat or is somebody come and, come and greet us? Oh, we're being greeted. It's a bit of a dingy shithole in here, isn't it? Oh, fuck, how we do? 
Oh god, look at this fun house or whatever it is, fun box. <laughs> Get out. Whoa, shit! I was looking over there at that mo, and this mo came down and fucking twatted me one. Oh, you cock. Alright, let's do this. Oh no, I can't get under there, can I? Oh, yes. Oh, that's... <laughs> this is ridiculous. Alright, we're going out this way, by the looks of it. Do you know what? That's not a bad little route up. If this is the only way up to the roof, we've got a ready-made path for, uh, for a horde base there. We can set up our little fighting position just here. I'm liking it. Okay. Now, I don't want to speak too soon, but this doesn't really feel like a tier 3 POI just yet. Although, there's no way we've been in fuck half of this place. Look at the size of it. Oh, and do you know what? We've acquired three points. And based on last episode and my little situation in the basement of the Zomboni Motel, I am inclined to spend a couple of points <laughs> in parkour. Now, I need to get to level two to be able to increase my jump height. I think I'm one point short, so I need to get to level four. So I've got one point left now. I can go there. I just need that one point and I can jump an extra block. So I think it was Jamal in the comments mentioned uh, that it was unlike me to be uh, going without parkour. And in the end, that's what killed me. So um, yeah, good shout Jamal, thank you for that. I'm going there next. And, oh God, speaking of going somewhere next, look at this. This has got disaster written all over it. Is there any way, can I get that? Yes. So at least I can see what I'm dropping into. Right. And get myself up to full health. Maybe I'll even drink a coffee. So that I can, uh, so that I can run or do something if I have to. Nobody in here? Well, I was not expecting that. Oh, what the fuck? That's not what I was expecting. Okay. Well, it is what it is. Uh, we'll leave those bits there. We'll come and loot. Oh, look at that. I can make pump shotgun quality one. Yes, thank you. Um, yeah, we'll come and uh, grab that stuff later. The stuff, all the good stuff's in there though, we've got to get behind there. So back up the fun box we go. Is that the same one or a different one? That's dead. Alright, we've got to find the right hole to go down <laughs> to get into that that main bit. Must be this way, it's got to be down here, right? No, hang on, so this is the restaurant, so the back... Right, where's the hole that we're going in? Oh no, hang on, there's some more stairs. Oh shit, I heard something bad. Oh, they're like their bloody vertical drops. Oh shit, he's a feral. Holy fucking hell. Holy shit! Oh, that was... that was fucked. <laughs> Did you see how hard he hit me? Yeah, that was not a normal biker. Oh my god. Uh, we'll loot later, once I've cleared this place out. Now, I don't want to get hit that hard again. That was absolutely 
Ridiculous. Oh, I don't even remember where I came in. Shit. Oh, this is tight now. Where's that noise coming from? Alright, we can deal with this. Okay, just two. Oh, and he's dead. Another irreversible drop by the looks of it. Have I got... Yes, I do. Okay, I think that should do it. I've never been so cautious. Oh, okay, fair enough. That <laughs> Does that get us out? Oh. Alright, big mama's coming. Oh, she's a fail. Let's not fuck with that. Right, if that dude is the only dude, we'll be alright. But, if he's not, as soon as I go that way, they're going to spawn in more zombies right behind me. I know it. I do not want to get sandwiched. There's going to be some good looting down here later. Oh, look at this for a stash. I feel like we're getting pretty close to what must be the stash soon. Yep, there it is up on the stage. I think I think I know what I'm going to do. We'll trigger them and then we'll come back here and then we'll just run around and hopefully we can shoot them through the uh, the kitchen thingy if we need to. So where do I need to go? To? Trigger the fucks. Probably all the way over there, innit? Oh no, that sounds like some footsteps. Here they come. Right, let's go back. The fucking double shot shotgun again. Oh, reload! Okay, this is going all right. Is he dead? He looks like it. We'll give him an extra round for luck. I think that might have been it. Oh yeah. Okay. Pirate Bay. <laughs> nice. This looks like a good uh, little stash. So we'll loot up. I'll um probably spend the rest of the day just secure in this place and um, yeah we'll live up on the roof as always the safest place <laughs> and uh, yeah then tomorrow we'll get out and explore some POIs maybe head over to Jen's I don't really want to have to start going through all the uh, all the missions again from from scratch so I don't know maybe we'll just go out and actually do POIs rather than fuck with the missions anymore so anyway let me clear this all up Okay, some good loot. Alright, so the first thing we're going to have to do then is just secure the roof by getting ourselves a way up there and then knocking out any other ways up the zombies can come. Unless I'm mistaken, this was the only way up. Although, hang on, no, we did come down another way, didn't we? So I'll just knock all this shit out so the zombies don't see this as a way to come up okay so that's clear okay that's done all right if this is our main fighting position we can probably afford like the room for a fallback point like here in case that does go down and then we can just have all of our regular base stuff up here i think that's a pretty sweet setup 
Um, so, oh god, look at that. Let's go sort out the zombies. I heard somebody knocking some shit down. Oh no. Can I get, oh yeah, we can get up there, like that. Okay, that's good enough for now. Who's doing all this banging? Alright, how much of a problem is this cat going to be? Need to get to my box slash bike. Cure this infection and then we can get to clearing this place out. Ooh, nice. Sweet. Alright, where did my medical go? Alright, we'll have one of those. One of those. Drink one of these, maybe even two. So can I, just out of interest, join a ladder. If I do this, can I actually get up here? Yes. Okay now, I can't believe how many, how many hits these guys take. Okay, so we are basically safe up here now, but we probably should build a, uh, a tightrope here as sort of reasonably soon um, so that the zombies don't just try to knock the whole building down should they get a lock on us for some reason. In the meantime, let me just get some temporary storage up here and I'll go and grab the rest of the crap from oh god the cat's coming how can i do this because he's just going to go inside isn't he right i'm gonna have to try and get as many headshots as quickly as possible no nope. i've lost him fuck where is he shit fucking jump scare My god. That was... <laughs> that was fucked. Alright, let's go get all my stuff and bring it upstairs. I'm going to spend tonight making this place a little bit more like home. And uh, yeah, then we'll come back in the morning. I don't know if I'm brave enough to go down and loot this place overnight, but we'll see. Maybe we'll uh, save that for another night or just like when we've got a couple of hours to spare. Tomorrow we'll go just check out what Jen's got, see if she... Uh, I, I, I do believe that her missions would be back to tier one. I think it was only in Rebirth that it was... Um, yeah, that sort of the, the level of your missions transferred across all traders. I forget now. But uh, yeah, we'll see what she's got. Probably not going to have any good missions for us. And then, uh, yeah, we'll set out tomorrow to explore the rest of this city and see what other POIs are around. And we'll, we'll kind of try to stay like on the roughly the same level as what we uh, left off before. We were sort of just got to the tier fours, didn't we, uh, in the last town. So maybe we'll try to kind of continue on that, uh, you know, on that kind of level here and just explore all the new stuff and check the city out. I don't know at what point we're going to take on that vanity tower, but that's... Uh, definitely in our future so let me sort this shit all out we'll get this place a little bit looking like home and we'll catch up in the morning all right it's morning and it's not much but it's home so uh, yeah this is where we came in earlier just to get a bit of context for where we are so I've, <laughs> I've stuck a couple of uh, blocks in the way here, just in case when we end up fighting hordes, we start getting spat at and it comes across here because, um, yeah, I noticed that when I started putting my workstations down, there was that direct line straight to the, uh, to the horde fighting position. Um, and yeah, this is it. I've set up a little crafting area around the back. I've got my workbench, my forge, and a couple of campfires. I've got my water collectors over there. I just started trying to make a shotgun, a pump shotgun, because yesterday we unlocked the tier one for that. And um, yeah, unfortunately, I don't 
have quite enough uh, well I haven't got any springs I left them at home I figured that we can just get more of those from scrapping cars and polymers we don't have many of I've just made some glue so I can get some duct tape going but once we get all those we can craft a tier one pump shotgun which has got to be better than this double barrel shotgun even if it's just tier one so uh, yeah that's what we're going to do we'll try and remember to pick up some polymers and springs while we're out and about today let me just get those uh, duct tape going before I forget. Oh, where's the cloth? So I've got my raw materials here. We can go, let's do 11 duct tape. Got building and parts. So that's basically just splitting the materials between raw and stuff that I've crafted. So things like forged steel and whatnot, plus parts can all go up here. Uh, okay, so that means Duct tape goes up there, raw materials, bones, and cloth. You can shove forged steel and my shotgun parts back up there because I can't use them right now. Um, let's just have a little think about this. Right, so need to prepare, need to make sure I've got enough stuff on me to survive the day today. So what do I need? Probably don't need my shovel or 60 iron. Let's swap that for that. Food and medical. Okay, so this, I mean, we're good for bandages, but we don't have much cooked food actually, so that could be a problem. We need, uh, need some vegetables so we can cook some more hobo stews. So that'll be first on our shopping list. Drinks. Let's grab these coffees. Like we'll just drink coffee today. After, I suppose, let's just fill up on water. And I probably need to have one of my last two hobo stews right now because we are almost starving. All right. So that is that. We'll continue just building everything out, sort of overnight during the night. Uh, this. Oh, okay. We've just got a couple of bits and pieces here. Yeah, I probably want to have a. Um, yeah, I need to set up like a guns and ammo cupboard somewhere. Uh, shotgun tube extender, that'll be good when we can craft that that pump shotgun. Oh, hello. Okay, is he not a feral? I can probably just take him out. Like this. Oh, God, they hit hard. Yeah, I need to think about my armor situation. Because I've been getting hit really hard lately. <laughs> Okay, anyway, for now, let's head off, just pop and see Jen, and then we'll do a tour of the city, see if we can, like, map out the uh, the perimeter of this place. Oh, hang on, look at this bullshit. It's haunting me. Hotel Zombona have got another branch out here. Those dirty bastards. this place it looks like it's been done up it looks really slick and glossy and shiny doesn't it all right here we are at Jen's let's go through the side door what have you got Meds, worth buying? Drugs, booze. I've got it all. Uh, I suppose we're at the stage where we can buy all these books. That's only 900. Urban combat, what's this? Craft military stealth boots, which have no stamina penalty. Let's take that. Gunpowder might be worth nabbing for now. It's cheaper than bullets. And we've got the other bits we need to craft with. Otherwise, not an awful lot going on here. Do you know what though? Nerdy glasses, XP gain 10%. I might buy these, although if I spend three grand on them, I'm guaranteed to find them within the next five minutes. But hang on, let me I see, what glasses am better. I wearing? Perception. Have I got anything in perception? No, it's completely pointless, these glasses. So yeah, let's buy 
those nerdy glasses and uh, yeah, stick them on. Now that was a good deal. Trust me. Let me just double check. I'm, I'm pretty doctor. sure, yeah, we're back at tier one. Probably going to be quite easy and a good way to um, to get some books. Maybe if we get bored, I don't know. Is it going to be worth doing that? Do we really want to power through and get all the crafting books by just cranking out a whole bunch of really easy missions? Let's think about it. We'll, um, we'll do a tour of the city first and then maybe do some other, uh, do some little missions. It depends. Maybe I can do that off camera if it's going to be too boring to watch just going through doing all these shitty little POIs. Um, yeah, let me know. So, okay, let's let's do a clockwise lap of this place and see exactly what we're working with. All right, so we've got downtown over here. Suburbia on the left, downtown on the right. Oh, Cracker Book headquarters over there. Unfortunately, actually not the best place to get books. Yeah, we've got a really big suburbia here. Just on the outskirts. How far does that go? Let's keep going. Industrial area, cock chemicals. Wonder if we can get some veggies over here just real quick. Just need some tatties now. Oh, there's that skill point. Let's put it into parkour now before I forget. Wee, I can jump. This is camping. More farms. This place has got a lot of every type of uh, city area. Oh, I didn't read what that Wasteland Treasures was. Okay, good stuff. So, what have we yet to uncover? Just this patch down here. All right, let me just uh, dump some stuff off at home. I'll probably um, just get some more gas from these cars in the parking lot. And then we will round this episode out with a POI raid. Don't want to just spend the whole day driving around doing nothing. But it's good to um, yeah, it's good to get a, a feel for the city and see what's around. We know we've got a lot of farmland. And yeah, there's a lot of every area. The in, we've got industrial, we've got farms, we've got downtown, and we have the uh, like the shops and all that kind of crap. I never know what that's called. Can somebody tell me? <laughs> Right, let's bungle our stuff away. God, we've got so much crap. Oh, actually. Oh, no, I've only got two fat. Craft. I know we can probably do a better one later. Or, you know, not too much into the distant future. But, yeah, I just want to... I want to get a reliable shotgun. Because that double barrel shotgun has been doing my head in. All right, okay. Let's uh, give this all another go. Head out. Oh my god, is that a wandering horde? Yeah, let's get out of here. Good time to uh, the moose. So what was that little patch? What direction do we need to go? This way. There's the Zelect. Did a cool horde base in there with the boys a while ago. Pine ball bowling. Oh god, what's this? We haven't even seen this place. Is that another factory? Never's game general. It's the hospital. Holy shit. <laughs> Poopy pen. <laughs> Look at that place. Poopy pens take care. I like it. Fire station 7. Yeah, okay, we've seen that. What's this? What tier is this place? Tier 3. Maybe we can have a look in here. Let me see. Can we deal with these fucks? I'll drink a coffee. Help with the old stamina. Oh, yeah. I can take that and party. Been 
looks like we're going over here. So, all right, try med group. Let's have a little looky. Oh, this guy's gonna come and get us from behind, isn't he? Oh, look, and there's that other, yeah, I've seen this on the Fun Pimps stream before they released Alpha 21, that place on the, uh, you know, that, that home that they're just moving. Maybe we'll go check that out as well if we get time. Right, I must remember to be extra, extra cautious. Alright, can we please go in here now? Oh, fuck that. Fuck! Open the door. Shit on me. Who hit me? There's another biker. Oh my god! Is he dead? Shit. Shit. Those feral bikers can fuck right off. Oh my god. We brought everybody in a 10 mile fucking radius. Right, what can we do here? Coffee's fucking sorting us out. Come on. You want to have a go, Nursey? Fuck off. Right, this time I'm not going to shut the door behind me on these stitchy doors because look, you can't you can't open it unless you get it right on the door frame. Oh, which way do I go? God. Okay, gun is loaded. Ooh, hooks. Sweet. Is that somebody? You want to fight? Yep. Oh, there's more than one. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Suck on that. This feels dodgy. Who opened the door? What? We've got self-opening doors now. I thought at least they had to bash through them. We get some sort of warning. Uh, feral, come on. It's got a feral biker. That oh, sounds lucky for that. Nice, nice. When did I unlock the ability to craft a nail gun? I don't even know. Level 5 pistols. Oh, we've got some crafting to do overnight tonight, guys. Andy Land, thank you very much. Okay, don't think there's anything in here. Fucking hell, it's nearly 7 o'clock. Right, we've got to, <laughs> got to get this place done. Alright, come on, one at a time please, if you would. I will just repair this, just in case. See ya! I just know I'm going to get ambushed any second. Okay, who's coming? Ah! Take care of you, love. No chicken curries. Uh, can I take out that bird before I trigger any other zombies? Here we go. Fuck off. I don't think that's the one. No. It's not a B1, but it's A1. Right. Oh fuck! Oh shit, there's a rad. And... Feral... Oh my god. 
Oh shit. This is how we do it. Oh, they're coming up. Okay, run. Fuck, move. I think my machine gun's gonna be for it soon. Ah, fuck. Yes, he's dead. Swat. Shit. Repair this bullshit. Ah, button. Repair. Yes, here we go. I think that's it. I think we are good to just loot this place and then looks like we can get down that way easily if we have to. Alright. Hopefully that bird won't piss me off, but... Alright, we use the lockpicks. And... Not really much going on here. Leather gloves. Oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Leather. Am I just an idiot? I can craft all this leather stuff now, and that's that's going to be... That's better than the padded, right? Oh my god. Right, we're definitely having a mega crafting session when we get back to base overnight. We are crafting an entirely new set of uh, leather armor. <laughs> we're doing our pump shotgun. Oh, we're going to kick some ass. And I can't remember what else it was now. Look at that, a nice little sham chowder. Ooh, another skill point. Bike, let's go this way. Oh, that's a lot of zombies. Is this normal or is that a, uh, a wandering horde? I don't know. Yeah, as I said, I'll uh, I'll spend tonight getting a whole bunch of crafting done. We'll have a new set of armor for the morning. And uh, yeah, hopefully we won't be getting absolutely smashed by every single fucking feral that hits us. Might even have a pump shotgun. Oh, hang on, that's going to be ready now. Look at this. And... Yeah, it's going to be a whole new day, ready to explore the city and try to survive. <laughs> we just about made it this evening. So anyway, I'm babbling. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I will get done what I've got to get done and we'll catch you in the morning. All right. Cheers. See you later.